Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Hopefully everyone's having a nice start to their weekend. In front of me here I have a hobby box of 2022 Topps Heritage High Number Baseball. Each hobby box is come with 24 packs, 9 cards per pack. You're either guaranteed an autograph or a relic. Most of the time it is a relic just like flagship hobby boxes. But every now and then you do get, if you get lucky enough, you will get a nice little autograph. And they're all on, on card autographs which is what most people prefer. And in my opinion one of the sweetest designs to get on-card autographs out of in Heritage. As, as we all know, Heritage is geared mostly towards set collectors, those who like to put the sets together. It is tough to get anything good out of this product since they do make a lot out of it. So usually when this product comes out, the hobby box is around like maybe 80, 90 bucks or so. But if you play the waiting game, just as I did, I got this box probably for like 50 bucks or less, which is what Heritage used to be back in the day from right here. It was a nice, cheap, open, fun rip as well. So let's get into this. Of course, the main rookies we're going to be looking for are Bobby Witt and J-Rod. see if we get lucky. Let's open up this box. And we do get a box topper here to start. And this is J.D. Martinez. I never know what to do with the box toppers. I don't really collect them. But we do have J.D. Martinez here. Who did play well for my Dodgers. Of course, he's still a free agent. I'm sure a team will pick him up. Still a solid hitter, even though he is getting up there in age. I'm sure the team will be out there to pick him up. Of course, I would like my Dodgers to get him, but we already have that position filled with Otani. Like I said, he'll get picked up soon. As we are getting closer and closer to spring training, for everyone to start reporting to camp. Here we are, we have our packs right here. Each pack is gonna have a different design of a player. Let's get into this. Of course, along with Heritage, there will be image variations that usually that you can find out on the back of the card. Luckily, Tops lately has been flipping those cards around so it makes it much easier. Before, you would have to go and look at the code of behind each card just to see if you have a variation. Or what Heritage does nicely is they actually write it on the back of the card. Which I understand why they don't do for every other product. So let's get into this. There will be short prints, high numbers, a whole lot of stuff here. And here's the design of that of this of 2022's Heritage. Starting off with this guy right here, here. Brendan Donovan, another rookie. Marte. Zach Grinky. Frankie Montas. Alexander Wells. Bradish. Perez and Hummel. We got Taylor Walls looking so serious in that picture. Adam Frazier, Celestino, Drew Smiley. You got an insert here of Lindor's three home run game. Bryson Stott, rookie, one of the Rookie chases in this product, Michael Chavis, Stephen Kwan, solid hitter for the Guardians, and George Springer. Like I said, we are looking for Bobby Witt and J-Rod. Hopefully we get an autograph out of this box. I haven't had too many heritage autographs in my history with this product. Logan Allen, Kopech, Jermaine Jones, Mount Castle. Rodriguez, Chapman, Canna, Sears, that guy. I've been too crazy so far. Matt Brash, Otto Lopez, Overton, Kendall Graven. I believe he is going to be done for the season after he's going to get surgery, so he's going to be out for the year. You got Boba Shed, that's a sweet shot right there. Trevor Story, pondering about life. Mark, hmm, Colos Very, probably butcher that. Then you got Kevin Smith and Dane Dunning. Next pack here Mackenzie Gore, not a bad rookie. Joey Bart, nearly panned out. You got Royce Lewis, nice rookie for the Twins. Of course, he's been dealing with injuries. 
Oh, it's a Jack Lopez. Rookie performer here at Suzuki. That's a nice one. Trey Turner, my Dodgers. That's Cameron. Elias Diaz. And Miles Nicholas. On to the next pack. We have Whit Merrifield. Kiner. Pinkinton. Anthony Rizzo. Josh Harrison, Kluber, Duran, throws like 100 miles per hour, Trevor Larnark, and Nick Lodolo for that Reds team. That looks to be fun, considering all the young talent that they have there. So that should be a fun team to keep an eye on during the upcoming year. Sandy Leon, Pinto, Reddings, Peterson. Hands Alberto, one time Dodger. Though he was solid for us. Jeremy Pena, that's a nice rookie to get. Even though he's on the Astros, but he is a solid hitter. He did have a down, kind of a down year, but you know, you can always bounce back. Next pack here Kyle Isbell, Suzuki, Mateo, Calhoun. So highlights here of Ron Santo. CJ Abrams, that's a nice rookie to get. Mountain Wade Jr. There you go, there's J Rod. One of the ones you're looking for. Behind him, we got Zach Short. If only we could get this one in a chrome or autograph. Honestly, I do like that. I probably, I don't know why, I prefer Heritage. The photos they use for Heritage over flagship at times. Let's see, now we can find a Bobby Witt. Zerpa. Juan Yepes. Cooper Criswell. McCutcheon. Diaz. Albert Pujols. Round of applause for him. That's on Kim. Howard. Freeland. Nothing much in that one. Still looking for our autograph or relic. My guess is going to be a relic. Prove me wrong. Prove me wrong. Gary Arias, Alec Baum, Josh Hader who just signed with the Astros for five years. That's a pretty big pickup for the Astros bullpen there. Kikuchi, who had a pretty good season. Brandon Marsh, Italian, Pache, Spencer Strider, that's a solid one. Solid pitcher out of the rookie class. Always strikes out all, strikes out a lot of people. Jacob Robson. Next pack here. MJ Melendez. It's pretty cool. Baez Scherzer. Birdie. Favorite pair of Red Sox right there. You got Bogarts and Devers, though Bogarts is no longer there. Packy, that's a funny first name. Brad Keller, Griffin Canning, and AJ Pollock. Solid player when he's on the Dodgers. Brady Singer, Prades, Akiyama. Oh, I forgot he even was still on that roster. Jock Peterson, Wade Miley, Owen Miller. Randy Dobnak, Alexi Hendricks. Last pack here of this first stack. Before I move on to the second one. And we still haven't gotten our hit yet, so that's a good thing. Save it for last, you know? Build the suspense. Luke Williams, Dury, Kirby, solid. Oh, there you go. There's Bobby Witt. Bobby Witt. I'm going to put him right here in front of JD. Easley, Gunter, Cabrera, Stevenson, and Nick Gordon. So we've got the two big rookie chases. Maybe we can find one of them in Chrome. Or we get a nice little autograph of them. Let's see, just a Sheffield. I don't know, Kirk. Owsley. There's Justin Brewer, solid reliever for my Dodgers. Contreras. 
Matt Olson, Tony Kemp, Matt Strong, who's also a card collector, and Kevin Kiermaier. Second rider, Craig Kimbrough is no longer my Dodgers, but he was all right. Josh Winder, Nate Lowe, or Lau, then got the AO Sign Award, Robbie Ray, Bryce Elder, Lou Darvish, Lucius Fox, and Jose Miranda. Osmer, Sanchez, Nick Plummer, that's a funny name, Daniel Vogelback, Joe Adele, hopefully he pans out at some point, Jack Sawinski, for all those who are still believing in him, Chris Bubik, Soler, who's still free agent, Ivan Castillo, nice to see Kershaw on this pack, hopefully he can come back as a Dodger and retire as one. I know he's going to get surgery, so he won't be ready to pitch until like the summer. Well, hopefully he comes back. Let's see, Moran, Luis Garcia, Bradley Zimmer. Let's see if I am. Hunter Green, that's a solid rookie as well. A hard throw for the Reds, Nate Pearson, Barrera, Mancini. Where is this hit? Jake McCarthy, Josh Bell, there's Gio, Jose, there's Nolan Ryan, Para, Jose Liquidi, Trevino, Carrasco, Carlos Cookie Carrasco. Tommy Romero, let's see, Seeger, Ramos, Garver. Arietta, Kevin, Chris Sell, Dom, Chick Myers, Palacios, Diplin, Solano, Noah Syndergaard, Tim Roberts. I know he collects his cards as well, I believe. Jack Flaherty. Crawford, Marcus Stroman, who's a recently signed at the Yankees. That should be funny. And interesting to see how that pans out for them, considering Stroman's had a history of talking some trash to about the Yankees organization and stuff. So as long as he's on good behavior, social media should be fine. Alec Thomas, Castillo, Cole Tucker. <laughs> little picture day right there, smiling. Hira, now and then, Luke, Ober, Barlow, Redick. Got three packs to go. So in one of these packs, there has to be a hit. A relic or our autograph. Bannon making a nice little diving play. Montero. Karen check, Benatindi. Oh, a nice Kershaw right there from our Dodgers. Oh, another Dodger here in Gosling. Clint Frazier, Suzuki, Paddock. Mark Cannon again, Sears, looks like a repeat here. Dunnan, Story again, hello. Oh, there you go. We got an autograph in this one, sweet. Here's our autograph, Patrick Wisdom, and it's not a bad one too. Solid hitter for the Cubs. Power hitter as well. Look at that. That's what I love about Heritage. Nice on card auto right there with the blue ink. Rocking the stash right there in that photo. Probably went yard in that photo as well. That was a nice one to get. Don't worry, I will make sure to sleeve that and put that in a top loader after this video. Soto. Yeah, gray. And that guy. Let's not, let's not go out, talk about him. It was worth it. 
it was worth it. For a second there, I was afraid I was going to be missing out on a hit, which has, still hasn't happened to me ever with Tops or Panini or any of those companies. So I'm lucky that hasn't happened to me yet. Crochet, we got Bradley. Oh, and we got a Chrome here coming up, and it's a Bryson Stott. That's not a bad one to get. It's a nice one. These are numbered as well. This will be numbered out of 999, 776 out of 999. Nice one to get. Chrome of a rookie. Not too bad of a hitter. We got Rick Performance here, CJ Abrams, Chris Bryant, whatever happened to him, Escobar, Mr. Anderson, and end off with Marcos Gonzalez. Overall, a success. I would say 100%. We got the Julio, we got the Wit. We did get a, a chrome of a rookie. I also count that as a check. And it's always awesome when you get an autograph. Considering most of the boxes that you get are going to be of relics. So I'm happy to get an autograph because I do love how the on-card autos look on Heritage. Nice and clean. There, Patrick Wisdom. Power hitter for the Cubs. And that's going to do it for today, guys. I thank everyone for... You know, tuning in and sticking by to the end to we get the hit. Most of the times, you know, when the hits come out early, some people start to dip. But I do appreciate those for for those who stuck by to to see the hit. And that's gonna do it. Hopefully, everyone's having a nice day out there. Enjoy your weekend. Stay safe out there. As for my next video, I will be opening um, Star Wars Chrome for next week. See if I can get lucky, get a nice little autograph, one of the one of the top actors. It'd be always nice to get a you know Anakin or an Obi-Wan, who knows? But yeah, that's what I'll be opening up next week. After that, I'll see what else. Oh, I do know Stadium Stadium Club should be coming out from last year. So I'll be looking to get a hobby box of that and maybe some retail of it as well. Do a little review of that product because I do enjoy Stadium Club for the photography. One of my favorite products as well. Up there in my pie top five of favorite tops releases every year oh yeah let me know down below what you guys think of the product how i did honestly i think it was a pretty solid box and also with the price as well you know like i said these were at the start were like 90 to 100 bucks probably around there and now you could just go get them at blowout or you know on ebay for like 50 maybe you know i'll just say 60 bucks and under fun cheap rip oh yeah i'll see you guys next week take care